after that scene, I remember going straight to the car and sleeping because I was so tired. I got so tired. Lalo lang magagalit sa akin si Dalia dahil may gusto siya sa'yo. Eh, wala naman akong gusto kay Dalia eh. Sa'yo ko may gusto. Oh my God, we were like babies. I remember being so, so like, um, scared. Cause, cause, parang, we would always like shoot at night. It was like horror genre every day. <laughs> so I remember being so, I mean, in one, like in one scene, it felt so real. And I really like felt um, so scared in one of like the scenes and I couldn't like shake it off. Then I had to like ask like a break from, from the shoot and they were like, oh, I waiting for me. And, but yeah, it was fun. These at the young mga fun days na in before na, na we were just like having having fun on the set. It didn't matter like what we, we were um, doing or what time we were doing it. Meron kami isang scene na, na there was a, like a big uh, fan on the set because it was so hot. So we just like had this like big gigantic fan on the set. And I was like chatting with my director, Lauren Jogi, and we were talking about the scene. And then all of a sudden, the Sira yung fan. But the blades were made of like wood, like this big. And then, and then it came off, and then it just like went like here, like behind us both. And we were just like, oh my gosh, we almost died. I will never forget uh, this movie because of uh, Johnny Delgado. So I remember I will never forget that scene. Um yeah, so he played a priest, like a troubled priest. I think it was like hustler, like a young hustler. And um I had I had a scene with uh with Sir John Mr. Delgado, Johnny Delgado, and I had to like mock him and make fun of him and like, you know, be like the bigger, you know, like the larger um character you know like and it was really really hard because i really had like his presence was just like so strong you know like johnny don't god that like he's like so he's a he's a legend he's an icon and 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 he's just like one of those actors uh, who has like a strong presence and i had to get drunk <laughs> to finish that scene not that I'm drunk, but I can't finish it. I mean, I was allowed to like calm myself down with a few shots of gin, para para makaperform ng maayos. Because I mean, I prepared, I did everything, but I remember sh shaking and being so nervous and excited at the same time. So I like, had to calm my nerves and okay. But I was able to do it. But after that scene, I remember going straight to the car and sleeping because I was so tired. Totally enjoyed this um, uh, experience working with Anne. I mean, shooting in in Baler, and you know, wearing a costume, and um, you know, I remember we had we built a um, a church, like uh, that was in that was our set. That was really cool. We shot, we shot the exterior shot. I mean, the exterior scenes in in Antipolo, and then and then inside, and we went to you know in, interior shots were like shot in in Balen. But but the entire thing was so. It's a real movie set, so that was quite an experience. And um, we had to learn a bit of uh, like Spanish. We didn't have a lot of time. A lot of time. Um, see, I think it was Ryan. Yeah, Ryan Eigenman. Slap me. Of course, on the face, and then natanggalin bigote, <laughs> natanggalin bigote ko. So, I still, I, I think I posted that 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 clip just recently. But yeah, this was um one of my one of my favorite films. Wait, oh, stop! Oh, stop! Na na lang na naman kita bago ka magassignment mo. Sinasabi ko, kapag nag-aral ka na maigi, scholarship sa magandang college. 
Yan naman sinasabi mo kapag kumakain This is my, my baby. This was my first time to co-produce. We received the script without um, dialogue. This was my first um, taste of like collaboration with the director really and I had so much fun with Ian Nunez and Bugoy Carino. This, I'm super proud of this film because it went to so many um, uh, festivals and we got to travel with this film and um, this was the film that made me realize that I want to keep doing this. I want to I wanna keep collaborating. I want to keep producing films. This is my inspiration for now, for, for this season in my life. So yeah, we're producing um, a film now. I mean, actually two films now and so um, I just keep thinking about this film. Oh, yung project mo. Ha? Ito, pangit. Hindi ko matapos-tapos. Ikaw, bakit ka nandito? Uh, ma... I don't know what I was doing here. This is my second um, film with uh, Mark Maley. I'm supposed to like play like a teenager and then like someone in his 40s. Sometimes you just, I, I just don't understand what I'm doing. <laughs> and, and then Mark just goes like, okay, good take. So I started going, okay, good. I mean, after finishing the film, I just felt so lost. And I thought, I thought, okay, I, I don't really know if I did. Okay yung trabaho ko or not. Yeah, it was fun. I mean, um, had fun with um, the cast. 